and welcome back to Final Fantasy 7 Remake and we are on chapter 14. I mean, what am I supposed to be doing or looking for? Huh. So I'm not supposed to be outside. Oh, what was it leading me toward? Maybe I am supposed to exit the house. Oh yeah, there's T5 here now. Okay. T5, what's up? Can't sleep? No. You too? I heard footsteps. Sorry. Didn't mean to wake you. I'm a light sleeper. It's a soldier thing. <laughs> that flower you gave me the other night? That was from Aerith, wasn't it? I knew there was something weird going on. You buying flowers? They symbolize reunion, believe it or not. I was curious, so I looked it up. I tried to keep it alive as long as I could. But now, it's dead and buried. 
Like the bar. Our home. And everything else. from us again You're hurting me. Uh. It's stupid. I know that crying's a waste of time. No, it's not. That's not true. Thank you. You've done more for us than we deserve. I won't forget this. If you ever need anything, all you gotta do is holler. Happy to help out, however I can. Elmira. I've been thinking about what you said. She's calling out to me. I can feel it. We all can. So please. She's our friend. We have to help her. Mm -hmm. I always knew it was coming. Knew that one day I'd have to say goodbye to my baby girl. But not yet. <clears throat> Please, bring her back to me. Hmm. Hmm. Marlene! Marlene. Are you going? Uh, I'm sorry, honey. I wish I didn't have to. I wish I could be with you all the time. I really do. But if I stay here, I can't fight out there. Some bad people are trying to hurt the planet. And Daddy, Daddy and his friends are trying to stop those bad people. The slums, your friends, the whole planet. It's Daddy's job to protect it. Hmm? <sighs> mm hmm. <sighs> And that's why I've got to go. You remember that nice girl who came to find you? Well, now we have to go find her. And when we bring her home, you need to say thank you, okay? Okay. That girl, she was kind of... <sighs> what? Nothing. You should help her. We will. You'll come back, right? Of course, I promise. <sighs> okay, you can go. She's tougher than me. All right, time to get some payback. Don't forget why we're doing this. I know, I know. To rescue Aerith. 
So, how are we supposed to get topside? With everything that's happened, the trains still aren't running. Well, we could walk along the tracks. The city's on high alert. All the roads and public transit have probably been locked down by now. So what's the plan then? You know another way up? No, but I think I know someone who might. You mean Corneo? I think I'm supposed to go this way. My this fellow way. grounders, listen up! Because again. boy, do I have some news well. for you! The office must be crazy right now. So after bombing reactors one and five, what do the eco-terrorists do? They go for the trifecta and take out Mako reactor seven. Another attack by amateurs who don't care about collateral damage. The sky is falling, and Avalanche is to blame. But wait! Did you know Wutai is the one funding their activities? For all their claims about fighting for the slums, they're nothing more than pawns of Wutai, puppets dancing to the tune of their foreign masters. And that's the truth. Topside news delivered straight to your ears. That'll be five gil. Five gil, come on! Damn, man. Knew we couldn't trust Wutai to leave us alone. It's the reactors. They want him, we got him. Does this mean there will be another war? After what they've done, what choice do we have? Five gill apiece, cough it up. The truth ain't free, you know. <sighs> we ain't no damn pawns of Wu Tai. I couldn't care less about the rest, but that shit. <clears throat> <sighs> no one will listen to us. There's no point in even trying. I'm sorry. Hey. Hey, Tifa, listen. There's no room in this for regrets or what-ifs or any of that. All we can do is keep moving forward, keep following this path we chose. Wherever, so we can say we did all we could. I know. But right now, instead of looking forward, you need to look around. Everyone here is terrified. So I'm asking you, don't. The collapse of the plate means that many people in the slums are in desperate need of assistance. I know we're short on time, but let's try to help out whenever we can. Yeah, I want to keep to the main story. Maybe hey, I'll do you. another one too. Right? Man, am I glad by I myself. You. Sam, he told me who you are. Said you're a merc and a former soldier at that. Listen, I hate to ask, but we got a few runaway birds. Mind helping us find them? Poor things were so startled by that plate coming down, they just up and bolted. I'm sure they're around here somewhere, frightened and hungry. <sighs> My poor birds. Worried about them, huh? All right. I think we can help you out. Oh, thank you. When you find them, feed them this. There's three missing all told, and their names are Coco, Lolo, and Momo. They'll come on home once they got some food in their bellies. Good luck. I'm counting on y'all. Okay, let's try to find the chocobos.
Do we really have to deal with Corneo again? Got no other choice. What? Did you guys get into it with him or something? I don't want to talk about it. Huh? Hey, Cloud. What happened? Don't recall. <laughs> So sad. Oh, hey, uh. Betty, I'm so glad to see you're okay. You too. Uh, where's Marlene? Is she okay? Don't worry, she's safe. Really? I'm so glad. Hey, can you help me with something? I'm looking for music discs for the jukebox. I think some new music might cheer people up, make them happy. That's a wonderful idea. Okay, if we find any music discs, we'll bring them straight to you. You just promised to crank up the volume, all right? You know I will. Thanks! The, the, there's nothing left for me now. Okay, let's see what the chocobos are. So I think I was supposed to be up here. No, I wasn't. So I did go a little bit too far. So let's head back up. So I was supposed to make a turn right there. Thanks for agreeing to find my birds. Someone said they heard it. heard there's a choke a chocobo was spotted near the old church. That's about all. It's re I'd bet good money those wandering birds are mine. This is bad. <sighs> Everyone, grab your stuff. We're heading out. I should just do that. Do the main quest. I go planning on. Take your time and walk at your own pace.
I saw it with my own eyes. A pu Public security team walks right into Corneo's mansion. The Coliseum is Don't open for business and hungry. I heard Don Corneo was missing. Let's go see Don Corneo. How many doors did this guy have again? No one's home. Long time no see. see. What brings you back here? Well, we need to find a way to get topside as quickly as possible. And we figured Corneo ought to know one. Is that so? In that case, I can help. You serious? Then tell us! Follow me. <clears throat> Let's just hear him out. <clears throat> so, what's the deal with the hole? Unfinished business. If you three give me a hand with it, I'll give you what you need to get topside. You want us to go back into the sewers with you? What's down there? Corneo's hidey hole. That's where I'm headed. You're not gonna try to screw us over, are you? If that's what you think, walk away. I'll find somebody else to work with. And you'll have to find another way to get topside. Mm. All right. We're in. Say what? He betrays us. He dies. Fine by me. He means it. I'll tell you more after we've climbed down. When you're good to go, let me know. You guys ready? Okay. Follow me. Let's go. Seriously, what's the deal with the hole? It's a trap for the Don's enemies. What? No one's ever gotten out alive. Well, until recently, that is. gonna hold up your end of the bargain, right? Long as you hold up yours, yeah. I don't trust you and I don't like you. So if you so much as breathe in a suspicious way, I'll turn that face of yours into a honeycomb. I'd save your bullets for the monsters if I were you. Some are a lot tougher than you'd think. Hate to say it, but I can barely take them on my own. You, on the other hand, shouldn't have any trouble, am I right? 
Let's get this over with. Head for the trunk line. It marks the border with Sector 7. You three lead the way. I'll follow a short distance behind. Those gloves up. Sure thing, coach. Let's this see won't how that take fire <laughs> On these guys. Let's make it hot. He didn't think we killed him. Let's check it out. Give him your all. Watch yourself. About damn time. <laughs> Going in. One will be was never in doubt. This won't take long. You're done. Got him. Oh, yeah. Another one in the bag. You asked for it. You're done. Buzz off. Keep it up, man. Yeah, you too. Everyone's doing a pretty good job.
Won't be tough. Of course not. It's so tired. All set. <laughs> what a joke. Good luck. Steady. <laughs> Hang back. Okay, let's go. About damn. Let me hear this. For a shower. Good job. Whatever, man. Let's go. The Mark of Avalanche. Right. Jesse and Big stashed a skeleton key down here. I never got the chance to thank them for what they did. Tifa. Let's just keep moving, okay? Hate to interrupt, but the trunk line's just through that door. The one over there? Yeah, we heard you. Maybe. About time. This way. There should be a door with Corneo's mark on it around here somewhere. Wasn't this locked before? Your time to shine. Clear the path ahead, would you? Yeah, yeah. Can I ask you something? Why did you help us out before? You could have lost everything. Andrea, he told me to. That really it? And I couldn't bring myself to let it happen again. Huh? It doesn't matter. Let's go. If this is what Get you ready. want. Let's do this. Give me your best shot. Gotta love it. Walk him off. Bam. You scared of something? There. Let's move, move, move! Not so fast. Wait. We're getting close to Corneo's hideout. From here on, I'll take the lead. So how are we supposed to get topside? Through here. Then you're telling me we're not done? Sorry guys, but it's not that simple. What the heck is that the 
amazing. No! Wait! We gotta catch him! Huh? He took the key to the door! Without it, we're screwed! Let's go. Bastard went that way! Don't lose him! It's over. Okay, and now I said cure everybody. Because that was a battle where we all lost a lot. Cure Tifa. And cure Faith. Just for the sake of it. And then give Cloud. And ether. When the hell did that thing run off to? Oh. I think this wasn't enough fun already. Nope, nothing down there. The area up ahead. It's that thing's den. Keep your eyes peeled. You never know when its friends are gonna pop up. Or where. somewhere up here. There we go. There's a passage through here. You ain't gonna get away. You've got 
Going in, going all out. Don't you let up now. Ain't got nothing on me. Tifa, you're ready to fire. Give him hell. I'm gonna enjoy Let me this. Not now, I can't. All right, watch and learn. Bring it home. Hang back. All set. Keep it up. Take the right. I'm on it. Your days are numbered, rat boy. He's so slippery. 
Just like his owner. Give it back! No holding back. <laughs> Don't overdo it. About damn time. I got this. Finish him off. There's still a chance. Now's our chance. Let's do this. I've got this. <laughs> Going in. See ya. That's it. Let's finish this. Phoenix down for cloud. We still got a job to do. Time for a serious ass whooping. Great. Give it back. That's. Give it back. That's not a key. Sorry. That's not your pendant either. Were they family? No. It was all just a dream, wasn't it? But one day? No. Time to wake up and forget. Six months ago. On that day, Corneo picked her as a bride, and on the next, she vanished without a trace. But before she did, she gave it back. Salt on the wound. Thing cost me a small fortune. Why did you want to come down here? Revenge. I know I need to let go, but I can't. I need closure, because without it, I'll never be able to move on. It's fine. As long as you get us topside, we're still in. Thanks. And don't worry. I got you. <sighs> you all right. I know a shortcut. Follow me. Okay, we do need to heal everybody again. Cloud is healed. Now let's do Tifa. Tifa is healed enough.
That twisted piece of shit. I'm gonna enjoy beating him to a pulp. Corneo's mine, and mine alone. Huh? Please. Fine. Wait outside. Think the kid's gonna be okay going in alone? It's Leslie! Got some urgent info for the Don! Mm -hmm. Come alone? Of course. Really? Without my little avalanche kittens? I thought I told you to round them up and bring them to me. Actually, it's them I came to talk about. Hmm. Uh. I think I need to remind you why I'm down here. Spilling the beans to those three escape artists was a serious mistake. And now I'm on Shinra's shit list. The plate stunt was meant to be an unprecedented tragedy, claiming countless innocent lives. But those naughty little kittens organized an evacuation and screwed up the plan. <sighs> I'll let you in on a secret. Shinra is going to abandon Midgar and build something close to paradise. I was invited to be a part of it. Dawn of a new and improved wall market! I'll be lucky to live another week. <sighs> Leslie. I was gonna let you run your own place. Give you a piece of the action. What a shame. Pop quiz time, kiddo! <laughs> Villains like us only divulge our evil plans in a certain situation. But what is that situation, hmm? When you think you've already won. <laughs> Goodbye. Think again, Don. Huh? It's you. You were talking about the Sector 7 plan. Keep talking, asshole. Ah! Over there! Over there, look! Don't try to bullshit us. But that's the thing. It's not technically bullshit when it's true. Uh. <laughs> 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 Feel free to play with your food. Gone out. Master! Uh. 
Oh, no. First him, then Corneo. Let's do this. Bring it. Shit. Okay, so I think Thunder, take out one of the horns. Let's do this. Guess it's my turn. Bring it on. Bring it home. I got this. Fuck on this. Now fire. And the white the horn again. Give him your arm. About damn time. My turn. Keep focusing on the horn. Okay, so I can't do anything yet. Oh no. You're out of luck. 